I want to talk to you today about the uh, Spyderco Endura 4 Emerson Wave Opener. I just got this. I've been carrying it for uh, about two, three months now, I guess. I got it in January of 09. This is a knife. I've uh, attached my own lan uh, lanyard on it. Um, and uh, I, as you can tell, I'm kind of into skulls. So I put a lanyard on it. And I'm also going to talk to you today about the uh, trainer uh, that goes along with the uh, Spyderco uh, Endura 4 Emerson Wave. Well, let me give you the stats on this. It is uh, 8 and 13 sixteenths overall length with a blade of 3 and 13 sixteenths length. It's VG 10 steel and uh, its length closed is 5 inches. Uh, cutting cutting edge is five uh, or three and seven sixteenths with a weight of three point six ounces. I actually put this on a scale at the grocery store and it came right out at four ounces, but that may be because I've added the lanyard to it. So uh, I don't know if that's the reason why it uh, ended up weighing out at four. But uh, overall, I love this knife. I've been carrying it as an EDC everyday carry knife for the last several months. And uh, I've been real happy with it. Um, it's done all the uh, EDC everyday uh, carry chores that I've carried with it. I uh, and its concealability. Uh, I've carried it in my uh, my strong arm side pocket, my right hand, because I'm right-handed. And um, I've uh, carried it in an ankle holster in other places where I went that uh, I didn't want it to be obvious I was carrying a knife until I got inside. And then I've carried taken it off my ankle and put it to where I could. Uh, get access to it easier but um, I, uh, I don't think I need to show you how the wave feature works there's several other videos out there how this clips on clips into the pocket and then this feature right here the wave feature it clicks clips to your pocket and then when you draw it out this actually hooks right at the rivet uh, the back edge of your pocket on your blue jeans and then that as you draw that draws the knife out and locks into the opening position it does take some practice uh, it is a little difficult to do when seated in a car with a seat belt on I found that out if you have to pull it like if you're at a bank ATM or something like that and somebody comes up on you and you want to pull your blade to defend yourself it's a little it takes a little practice to pull it out while you're seated uh, but standing up it's not a problem pulling it out while you're standing up not at all it's kinda of like you pull up and draw to the back and that way you push you're pushing this to the back of your pocket so you can hook that on the back of your pockets right about where the rivets at at the back of your pocket and uh, that is about all I have to say for about that there are several other videos on YouTube that you can uh, look at that show you the wave in action being drawn from a pocket. The other thing I wanted to talk to you about today was the trainer that goes along with this. This is the uh, Spyderco Endura 4 Emerson uh, trainer. Its number is C10TRW and the other Spyderco uh, with the live blade is c 10 PGYW for the wave uh, opener and uh, I picked uh, the the wave opener I picked up for about $72 and then the trainer I picked up for about $73 at a gun show uh, the manufacturer suggested retail price on both of these is $114.95 uh, you can get them online a lot cheaper and you can pick them up at the gun shows if you want to go I suggest going to a gun show because you can actually put it in your hand and you can feel how it fits your hand and um, um, if it's going to work for you. You can also notice on the spine the jimping and the handle material and the handle material in this is the uh, uh, FNR uh, which is uh, for fiberglass, fiberglass nylon reinforced uh, material and it's the same way on the trainer. Uh, this comes in green. I don't believe they've got it in any other color other than this real dark green that it comes in. And then it's got a lock black, a lock back with uh, the Boyd Dent um, lock back, you know, with the cutout right there. And um, anyway, that's the uh, Endura. 
Now here's the trainer. I got this because I practice martial arts and I wanted to carry a trainer that I um, that I can train with in martial arts class of my everyday carry blade. And so when I'm doing drills and katas and stuff like that, I use the trainer. The specs on the trainer is it's uh, the same length, the same weight, uh, with a weight on it's 3.6 ounces, which they say is the same for the Endura Wave. Uh, there's no cutting edge, and the steel is AUS6 on the trainer. And um, there again, it's got the wave feature, um, the uh, lock back and pocket clip and then I'm kind of into skull so I put another uh, lanyard on this one this one's uh, fluorescent uh, pink uh, so that way I always know it's a trainer when I grab it um, and um, I put the skull on there just for the uh, for the aesthetics of it but uh, yeah this is a great knife to train with if you're going to carry the Emerson Wave uh, you might as well um, uh, carry the trainer and practice with the trainer at the same time well that's about it for me uh, if you want to see uh, the wave in action uh, go online and just type in the Endura Emerson wave uh, Endura 4 Emerson wave and there are at least a dozen videos of people out there using the wave feature but I just wanted to review these two knives and say that I'm very happy with them I couldn't ask for a better knife both knives have the jimping on the back uh, they're almost identical except for blade steel. One, one is a live blade and one is a training blade. So go out and that's, uh, I spent basically $140 on two knives. So that's not a bad deal for an EDC blade that you're going to carry every day and a training blade that you can practice with your quick draw and uh, the likes of that. So thank you. Again, this is Stagata. I hope you have a uh, fun time watching my video. Thanks.